If I tell you I'm good, probably you will say I'm boasting. But if I tell you I'm no good, you know one line. <laughs> Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Dr. PGNG Emperor. He's got to get money back for another YouTube video. Banger, man. Yes, sir. Yes, man. I don't know what time it is. The Dutch is in the house, man. Check this out. So we have some news as it pertains to Javante Tank Davis. Again, with some more speculation to add to the already rampant rumors going out in regards to when he's fighting, where he's fighting, who he's fighting. You know what I'm talking about? So, so we just go add to it a little bit, mix it up a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Add to the pot, you know? So apparently, you know, there's there's been adding more fuel to the fire of the speculation surrounding Javante Tank Davis supposedly fighting uh, Jose El Rayo Valenzuela, right, in the uh, for, for for his next fight, you know, in the imminent future. Now, as you know, initially everybody thought that um, November second was a date um, for his next fight, but apparently, according to the reports going out, you know, um, according to Michael Benson and some others, uh, Javante Tank Davis could be having a fight on December fourteenth, and that fight could be with him sharing. They could see him sharing a card. With with uh, David El Monstro Benavidez, so that's dope, man. Because you know they had, they shared a card earlier, and I thought that was a successful card with David Benavidez uh, uh, fighting his debut at light heavyweight against Alexander Vostik and um, Javante Tank Davis fighting uh, Frank the Ghost Martin, man. So I thought that was a good event. This would be dope to see them share another card. You know, I think the more people sharing a card, the better for the for the consumer, and especially if it's going to be pay per view, the buyer as well. You get more bang for your buck. But also, you know. Um, it seems like we have more hints coming from Ryan Garcia as to who Javante Tank Davis will be fighting on December 14th. And <laughs> according to this, he's saying that he's fighting Ryo. You know what I'm saying? The Lightning. Now, this is Ryan Garcia we talking about, so we got to take his words with a grain of salt. You know what I'm saying? Because his, his, his past is looking a little shaky, baby, when it comes to the truth. As you know, he'd been, he, he been cheating and lying and snitching before. <laughs> so, you know... <laughs> But all jokes aside, though, man, I think this could be right, you know, but at the same time, who would refute that? Well, the all the all time great legendary coach, Robert Garcia, who's happens to be coincidentally the coach of Ryo Valenzuela. He's been shooting down the, the fact that him that Ryo and Tank will meet next. But you got to pay attention to the new to, to, to the to the, uh, sm the small and fine print, you know, the smaller details, the 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 the, uh, the nuances, you know, the context, you know, and the circumstances. He has been repeatedly, and 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 uh, I'll even say, adamant about the fact that Ryo will not fight Tank next in November, for that November date, that November second date in particular. Tank has pushed it back, according to reports, to December fourteenth. Robert Garcia ain't never say he won't fight him in December. He ain't never say that he can't get take eventually. He just said very adamantly and vehemently that he did not want uh, his fighter, Ryo, to fight Tank in November. You know what I'm saying? Because it was too quick of a turnaround. Now, does December change some things? Does the amount of money you get make you make some, you know what I'm saying? Make, 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 make some, uh, go, go an alternative route? Or, or reconsider some things. I think Buddy does, you know, and the fact that, you know, maybe they are negotiating. Ah, I can't speak right now. <laughs> maybe they are negotiating, and in the negotiations, they said, Ryo side, hey, we can't fight in November, man. That's too short notice. So then, you know, everything about negotiations, a lot of things happen in negotiations. Apparently, everybody knows if you, if you get to let the YouTube boxing community tell that everybody knows what goes on in negotiations, but just a general thing. In negotiations, what is it? It's that sometimes you give and take. So maybe Tank wanted November, but Ryo was like, hey man, that's too soon. So they compromised. You know what I'm saying? Maybe Ryo didn't want to fight till next year, but they made a compromise to fight towards the very end of the year in December. Maybe Tank wanted to fight in November, but he wanted to fight Ryo. So he's like, oh, all right, bet. I'll give you an extra month. You know, I'm not, I'm just speculating here. We don't know. But you know, negotiations, good, great negotiations and when deals are made, it's usually, it sees both sides giving and taking a little bit, you know what I'm saying? A little bit here, a little, little bit there. No, did he? So, you know, it's, it's not really evidence per se to prove that he's fighting Ryo. But like I said, I think that that's where the uh, all evidence leads to, you know, all the breadcrumbs leads for, 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 for Tank to be fighting Ryo next. But we'll see, you know, this is not even, like I said, this is this is reported that he's fighting on December 14th. Emphasis on the reported part. So nothing is finalized with him and David Benavidez sharing a car. Definitely can't take anything Ryan Garcia says uh, uh, <laughs> uh, seriously. But I do think 
you know, it aligns with all the clues that we've been getting. And I do think that he's on to something, man. Cause I, and I agree with him, you know. But we'll see if it, only time will tell, right? So that's it right there, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think about that. Do you think it'll be a great card for Javante and, and David uh, uh, to share again? You think that's a great thing for them to share a card again? Who do you think David Benavides will be fighting? Do you think uh, Tank will be fighting Ryo or somebody else? You know what I'm saying? And do you think that all this is just a whole bunch of BS, you know? But we're going to find out eventually, man. I, I appreciate y'all rocking with me. And remember, with God, we can do anything without God, we are nothing. The doctor's out. Peace. From the hood to college, both worlds they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets.